Good morning, everyone. My name is Anina, and I have been living and traveling here in beautiful tropical South India, Kerala, for more than 10 years now. And in this episode, I want to share with you things to know if you are planning on traveling to Kerala, and also some of my favorite places to visit here. So by the end of this video, you'll have some pretty amazing things to add on your India bucket list. So stay tuned, and let's get started. So I'm going to start with the biggest celebration here in Kerala called Onam, which celebrates the end of the monsoon rains and welcomes the harvest. So also known as the festival of rainflowers, Onam is celebrated for 10 days. And if you visit here during this time, you'll see that each day of the festival has its own rituals and traditions. Since Kerala is located in South Asia on the tropical Malabar coast of India, the climate here is hot, humid and rainy depending on the season. I could talk to you for hours and stay up all night And when morning came we make breakfast in bed I don't Number two on the bucket list is to visit a place called Fort Kochi and go see the famous Chinese fishing nets. Hi, let's go. Kochi is a coastal city here with a very long and colorful colonial history, so you can see all kinds of ancient buildings and bungalows there that tell the stories of Kerala's past. The Chinese fishing nets that are actually hundreds of years old are still used today and they're usually operated by a crew of local fishermen. Today's forecast, a lot of sunshine, blue skies, marine clouds. Just a perfect day to go outside and relax. That's your forecast. We'll be right back. No matter what type of traveler you are, there are so many options of hotels here to choose from. We have hostels, resorts, villas, and even heritage buildings you can stay at. So today I'm gonna mention three different kinds we've personally really enjoyed.
My next tip is to not miss out on all the hidden gems of the capital city. Thank you. Trivandrum is my hometown here and for that reason I feel like I could give you at least 50 amazing things to do here that most travel guides out there don't have on their list. When it comes to transportation here, what's great that within a city you can use Uber, so you can download the app and book yourself either a rickshaw or a car. Another way is to simply catch an auto on the go whenever you see one or from a dedicated rickshaw stand. In Kochi, for example, they have a really nice new metro that's really easy to use. And when you're traveling from one city to another, my best tip is to always take the train. The next place I'm gonna recommend is a beautiful hill station called Wyanot. Come say hi. They're calm now. Come. Okay. Come. So Wayanad is easily one of my favorite places here and it's where you can find those famous green hills with tea and coffee plantations. <laughs> 